Danny Boy's first actual hunt back starts right now. This is right to the brink of too much. I'm tested and found one thing. I just whipped over three. Whip, whip, whip. I think they probably smell some corn body odor. You jerk! <laughs> Just straight knee deep mud. <laughs> Guys, I'm very surprised by, by Elliot's non Nazi esque blaze. What is the matter with you two? <laughs> See, the hunts I remember is when you would drag me into like the abyss of like swamp. Yeah. Cold. Yeah. Is that why you quit? Water everywhere. Is that why you quit? No, no, <laughs> no. That's not, that's not why I quit. I missed those days. There's the man! Hey guys, how's it going? I say, man. I'm so tired, I'm dizzy. Are you? I am wide awake this morning. <laughs> not me. Uh, you made a lot of people happy last video by showing up, man. I know, I know. I saw the comments. It was kind of uh, culty. <laughs> Maybe this time we'll actually see a duck. I don't think we even saw a duck on that deal. No, 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 we didn't. It was a um, piece, I think. Well, All right, piece. let's roll. We have arrived. You put your waders on. I forgot how to do everything. <laughs> it's like, oh, I'll just, I'll just carry my waders into the swamp. That's what I was thinking. <laughs> yeah, might be able to do it. Pretty much a hate-hate relationship with this thing. We've got old Phil with us. Hey. Good morning, everybody. It's just Dan and Phil and myself today. Left his car of decoys at home. Yeah, they're too heavy to carry in this place like this. But if you want to see a video where we hunted over his car of decoys, I'll put it up there. You can check that out. That was last year. We had a good time. Either, I say we just go down through this little trough right here. Well, we've got two creek crossings. Like I said, we've never been in here before. This one's actually, this is the smaller creek in the, it's a pretty steep incline here. But I think we found a little spot. Dan said he was gonna try to go across this tree, but I don't think I'm going to encourage that. I could slide like a, like a little kid on a pole. Just... No, it's probably, I mean, it's probably not the best plan to try to go across that. But look at how much energy I'd save. I'd already be on top. Yeah, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna stop you. I'm not gonna encourage you, but I'm not gonna try to stop you. That's see, that's the form of government I like. <laughs> yeah, no, 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 no. <laughs> see, uh, I think uh, four years ago I probably would have been uh, <laughs> yeah, right? co coaxing you, maybe. <laughs> I think four years ago you would have done it without my coaxing. I think if I didn't have this, I'd do it. Yeah. That's what I All right, here we go. This isn't bad. I mean, there's virtually no water down in here. I can't wait to see the next one because this is the smaller of the two. We're at our second creek crossing. Definitely this one's deeper. Just straight knee deep mud. Oh my gosh. He made it. Second creek traversed. I hear the plaque falling off of my arteries right now. <laughs> 
You can feel the plaque coursing through your veins. Oh, oh my BP is. Yes, thank you for the face wash. Well, our work is done here. We got about 50 minutes till shooting time. Danny's all taking a little, little nap. Guys, I'm very surprised by by Elliot's non-Nazi-esque <laughs> ways. I'm really relaxed when it comes to cover. Well, you, I don't think we ever hunted under trees before. No, we. I don't. Think no, hey, you remember when we were okay? You remember that hunt where my dad got lost in the woods and you had to go find him? Yeah. Did we, that's that place we didn't have crazy Nazi cover because we no, were under trees. No, but I still remember. Get down. What's it? What's that on your nose? No, here, no, no. Shiny. Here's what Get you remember. Here, here's what you remember. Why is that orange? Get rid of that. No, he, here's what you remember. <laughs> right. We finally got in there, okay? And the ducks were working, and you and Aiden set up to make pancakes, not way back in the trees, <laughs> like right out in the open. You guys were moving around. You were walking. You were making pancakes, and there was ducks circling. And so I got annoyed. Because you, you guys did it right out in the open. Do you remember we were like face to face, just talking like schoolgirls, just like, yeah, how are you doing? Like just in the open, you're like, what is the matter with you two? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. But the, but as far as our cover in there, we didn't do a lot of it. No, I I, I beg to differ. You're gonna have to look at the like. Let's let's go to the videotape. Okay. That one newscaster. You All right, I will cut to the video right now. <laughs> All right. All right. Now well, there's Aiden and Trimble Timer and old Danny boy. He was out karaoke in last night. That's what happens when you karaoke before a duck hunt. What songs were you singing? You sang that song. <laughs> Keep singing it. On a cold and windy Chicago morning, the boy is laying face down in the ghetto. <laughs> All right, and so as you guys just saw, I see I can say this now before watching it because I know. Yeah, no. Uh, he, we did not do much cover. Uh, was he a Nazi? Yes or no? <laughs> well, you know, I can be a little bit of a ductator from time to time <laughs> about certain things that need to be done as far as cover but i was but, a cover right yeah you're a cover machine but i love cover my point is that when you have trees and when you have top cover you don't need a lot of you don't need a lot of cover yeah no in this, front of you this is a we've never had this i i've never been experienced with this all you need is top cover and you blend in hold still against a tree and you're pretty much good See, the hunts I remember is when you would drag me into, like, the abyss of, like, swamp. Yeah. Cold. Yeah. Is that why you quit? Water everywhere. Is that why you quit? No, no. <laughs> I know. That's not, that's not why I quit. I miss those days. Well, nothing so far. Quiet. If this doesn't work out... We're gonna pick up and go try some other pool on this complex. We have not had even had anything fly over at this point. We'll see. Got a couple that are. Those looked like they were. Those are the best two we've seen. Well, those two kind of circled up over there a little bit. Those were those were the best two I've seen. Our plan, we this is a really hidden little spot, and so I found this place about 12 years ago. I walked in and scouted it a couple of times, and I never hunted it. And last year, I told Golden Boy about it. He hunted it. He shot six mallards. Of course. So this is actually the first time I've ever hunted this place. And we're just trying to feel it out to how often birds are in here, how much they use it. So the movement, we've seen a few, but nothing has really been interested in what we have here. Uh, there is not much wind today, so we're going really small. We've got that, I don't know what that's called, but got that splasher. And we've got four, a set of motion to...
Get him. Yeah, crap. Well, hey, something finished. Sit. Oh, man. Well, as I was saying, <laughs> that was crazy. I was talking. <laughs> We've got another set of motion decoys over there. But, hey, at least we had something come in. Have you ever seen a duck dumb enough to come back around? No. Well, teal. Well, hey, but at least we had something come in. Yeah. yeah. That's encouraging. That's more than I've had in the last month. That was encouraging. Just would have been a little more encouraging if we had killed him. Yeah, well, at least we know that we have a chance because that Drake did it perfect. Well, not perfect because he wasn't hovering, but he kind of banked and swooped in. Not sure how good the video was on that, but we've got better hope now, that's for sure. Well, we gave this place a try. We're going to pick up, walk out of here, go drive the complex and scout and see. There's been quite a bit of shooting off towards the, the complex and the pools, so... Um, maybe we can still get into a different spot and set up again and, and be productive today. It's early. It's only like, it's not, it's like 8.30, I think. So it's still plenty early. So we'll get out of here and see what we can do. If this hunt is continued, to continue, we got to fix a leak on Danny's waders. Man, I don't know. You're going to have to, jeez. The chance of being able to get this to work is the limitations of duct tape, maybe. slim. <laughs> It ain't sticking. Yeah, it's too wet on the inside. I mean, the chance I'll of this, seriously. On the, outside too. Yeah. the chance of this working is not good. Well, here we got our second spot here. We feel pretty good about this place. We're kayaking in, we're setting up the A frame. Here we go. There are mallards flying everywhere. I don't know if you can see them through this. I mean, there's mallards flying everywhere out here. You know, everywhere. Everywhere. Oh my gosh. I'm getting excited. That doesn't mean we can get them in, but this is exciting. We are now. We're in a totally different spot hey, here. Ducks working. With an A-frame. There's ducks everywhere. There's also a lot of hunters in this pool as well, so I don't know. This time of year, there being a lot of ducks out here and us shooting a lot of ducks are two totally different things. There are ducks everywhere out here. Everywhere. The problem is there's hunters everywhere out here. I'm counting one, two, three, four, five, six, seven groups that I can see. And I bet you there's at least three others that I can't see. And that's why we don't come here very often. That's why we don't come here very often. It's just, you know, everyone wants to shoot birds, so you can't blame them, but it just makes it really, really difficult. You can hear that motor. There's boats coming in. It's just constant motors running. It makes it really, really hard to get anything to finish. About the time the birds kind of start working, someone somewhere on the pool takes a shot and that resets the birds. So there's lots of birds in the air, not right this second, but Lots of birds in the air, not lots of birds finishing on anybody. For the number of birds in the air, I don't know where those guys think they're going to go. For the number of birds in the air, there's very little, very few shots going off. These are late season smart birds. We got, we got these guys there. I don't know if they have an A-frame, maybe. And then we got, where's that boat at? I don't know where they're going. They're coming. They're coming or going, I can't quite. They're coming in. And I'm not sure, there's no place over here with it for them to set up that I can tell. Three guys there. I don't know if they have a boat on it or what. We'll see where they end up going. The last group that tried to come in like them got up in the shallows and ran their motor for about 30 minutes straight. So. And there's a group clear on beyond them. I don't know if I see them clear over there. It looks like they're going now. 
it's really shallow out here. And then there's a group. Let's see. Clear over. Where's their spin around? Let's see. There it is. Still yeah, clear over there. There's that group. Everyone thinks that this state is so magnificent. I'll tell you what, there is precious little public land. So before you start thinking you can just come here and shoot a bunch of birds, it's very, very difficult to get birds out here a lot of times because there's just so much pressure on such a small area. You guys think, we've yet to bag a bird. Oh, you guys know why we haven't shot a bird. Because I missed. Because you two whiffed <laughs> away. Yeah. <laughs> Story of my life. That's all right. All right, guys. Well, we gave it a try. Yep. We tried two different spots. One with no people and no ducks. One with lots of people and lots of ducks. The result was the same. <laughs> Actually, the first spot with no people and only one duck was better because we had one duck come in yeah. and we had it to ourselves and it was a beautiful place. Uh, and yeah. I fell down the creek. Yeah, and I didn't get it on video, man. <laughs> I wish I'd been rolling. <laughs>